Alright guys, you saw the title thumbnail of this video. We're going to be continuing our series in Age of History 2 of literally conquering the world as Luxembourg. I'm not joking. Yes guys, this is a challenge that I started off as a joke, but the video actually performed mediumly well, so I think that you guys will be interested in me continuing the series. But anyways guys, if you enjoyed this video, please drop a like and a sub, as I would really help the channel a ton. And uh, if you really enjoyed this video, you can also drop a super thanks and turn on captions if it's difficult to hear my voice over the music. Anyways guys, like in this video, we have some goals, specifically two. Number one, we're going to try to take over, like, all of Europe. And number two, we're going to try to take over, like, the entire Mediterranean Sea. Hopefully, hopefully we can do that. Uh, if we can do that, then, uh, yeah, I think we're going to be doing pretty good. And what the heck happened here? I'm not going to question this. Anyways, guys, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's kind of just get in this. And basically, guys, uh, what we're going to be doing, first of all, probably... Uh, I'm not gonna question what happened here, uh, okay, Greenland is in Canada, and there's apparently two different Greenlands, I'm not gonna question that, but first I guess, uh, we're going to assimilate, I'm not really sure what we're supposed to assimilate, I think we assimilated everything, but okay, um, we'll just continue the assimilation, okay, cool, and there's our entire army, and I guess we'll kind of just go to our capital, and we'll try to make it like the most powerful city ever. Trust me, this is worth it. Because, well, to be honest, why not? It's not like we have anything better to do right now. Although we could, like, actually start to invade Europe. And never mind, our technology is way too low. Uh, let's invest into research. Let's swap back to political. And now, let's send our army to go for Finland. Because, let's be honest, I don't think Finland is going to survive 115,000 troops. Like, yeah, that's just not going to happen. So, let's do this. And, actually, let's just spread out our troops. Okay. Let's recruit again. And now, of all these troops, I guess we're just going to send, like, most of them to go for the mainland of Finland... Oh, yeah. Let's just take this really quickly. Okay, there they go. And now... Let's just recruit some more soldiers. So we can also invade from Norway, since they have annexed to Norway. Okay. Let's bring our army right there. Now let's recruit from Denmark. Remember guys, we're recruiting all these soldiers just to make sure like 100% we're not going to lose the war because trust me, losing it uh, will be pretty problematic. We're just gonna bring everyone here and then send them to the ocean because I really want to make sure that like we don't lose. That's the idea behind it. Come on. Okay, finally. We can actually just start the invasion. I just realized making a port uh, would take less time. Okay, cool. Well, there goes Finland. And Russia hates us. Okay, I guess we'll try to improve relations. And Ukraine also hates us. Actually, no. We'll just make you our vassal. Why did I do that? Okay. Uh, I did not click the other button. Um, I mean, who can we vassalize? Eh, okay, never mind. Uh, you know what? Let's just get this over with. Realistically, they're not going to win. So we really shouldn't be too concerned about it. Although at the same time, you never know. They could just pull out a million troops from the middle of nowhere. Because, yeah, this is Age of History 2. That always happens. Do this, and that. Now let's go right there. And there. And there. And there. And there. Okay. 
not to do this and that. And now let's kind of just send our army everywhere. Since you know at this point, uh, we can't exactly be stopped. Okay. Why did I do that? Well, that was a mistake. Uh, don't worry. It's not like it's going to be that big of a problem. Wow. Uh, yeah, we need to send some soldiers over there because uh, that front is getting really weak. What the? Okay, weird. Why did I do that? Uh, refuse. Okay. Wait. I have an idea. Once we're done invading Finland, we'll just annex Sweden. Wait, did we actually lose? Oh, 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 no. Trust me. Uh, this won't end terribly. Yeah, that's literally it. Finally! Okay. And there they go. Now send our army to Berlin. Like, literally everyone. Because now we need to assimilate. And that's going to take some time. to the assimilation map and now we're going to spam amazing there's literally nothing else we can do i mean to be honest it's a little annoying but i mean yeah if we don't want to face a revolt we don't really have a choice I need the money. Uh, okay, cool. Anyways, now, can we annex Sweden? Seven turns, okay. What? Seriously? Oh yeah, I almost forgot. We have a colony uh, that we annexed from, uh, I think, Germany. Okay, four more turns. Let's do this. Now three more turns. Uh, two more turns. Not swap to Sweden. One turn. Okay, there they go. Now to do this, and now let's assimilate. Well, this is gonna be annoying. Okay. 
Okay. By the way, guys, if you're wondering, this is actually part two. So, like, if you haven't watched part one, I know this makes absolutely no sense. So, you should probably watch it if you haven't already. Anyways, now... Let's continue going for the Mediterranean. Uh, honestly, we could go for Slovenia. Actually, speaking of which, let's go for them. Let's just make sure if they have any soldiers at the border, like how many. Wow, they don't have any. Okay. Well, uh, yeah, that's good for us. Because that means we can invade them really easily. Okay. Let's bring our army to the border. Come on, it really can't take that long. Assimilate before we can even invade. Amazing. Okay. Send our army right there. Honestly, if anything, this is mostly just assimilation. And wow, we are already going broke. I can tell because our money is literally just crashing. We might have to cut funding for research at this rate, and uh, yeah. We're gonna have to do that. We really don't have a choice. Okay. Let's get back to assimilating. Let's just demand Moldova. I highly doubt they refuse. Because, I mean, it doesn't really make sense for the AI to refuse. Actually refused. Okay, well, uh, never mind. We'll take all your money anyways. Now... Okay. We need to also defend these provinces. Well, maybe this was a bad idea. would have ended uh, by the time these troops arrive. So we can just recruit normally. Come on. One turn. Okay, well, there they go. Anyways... Uh, let's declare war in Slovenia. And I think we're ready... Are we... Yeah, we are. Realistically, we can't lose, right? 
I mean, like, I'm not saying it's impossible, but, like, realistically, it's not going to happen unless all of a sudden they summon, like, a trillion troops, and, uh, yeah, this is Age of History 2, so, I don't know. Once I doubt it. Trust me, this is, uh, like, far more interesting than just the vassalizing. Uh... Okay. Never mind. We have a problem. Actually, we probably don't, like... Okay, I know this looks bad, but like... No, not really. Well, uh... Oh, whoops. Uh, where else? Oh, here. Let's just finish off Slovenia, like at this point, uh, yeah, it's pretty much like 99% over for them. Oh, there they are. Is that it? Seven provinces? Where? Wait. Let me just check something. Oh, there they are. What? Don't worry. Wow. Anyways, uh... Uh... Right there. Wait, what? No. Okay, cool. Wait, but where are they now? One province. Uh, we'll deal with that later. Where are they? Oh. Okay. Anyways, guys. Please give me a moment to assimilate everything and to kind of just gather all our troops. Alright guys, I'm back. Uh, yeah. I kind of just assimilated everything now. And all our troops are in the ocean. So I think you know what that means. We're gonna continue invading Europe. Romania. Uh, yeah, there you go. And Greece. Sorry. Wow. Eh, it's not like it matters. Oh. Okay. And that. Not to simulate. Now send our army back to the ocean. Because remember, the goal of this video, we're going to be taking the entire Mediterranean, and what the heck is happening here? We'll ignore that. Uh, who can we go for? I guess Libya. They're not an amazing target. But to be honest, we don't really have any better targets. Am 
by the way, I'm beginning to realize how long this video is taking, so we should probably go a lot faster. Let's gather up our army to the ocean, because to be honest, why not? Uh, refuse. Still refuse. Let's do this. And now, Algeria, we're going to make you our puppet. Yay. Now give me all your money. And now, let's send our army to uh, fight Spain, I guess. But first, let's build some watchtowers. Nothing. Okay, uh, watchtower, and a uh, watchtower. Oh, there is. Well, uh, that's useless. Realistically, we're not going to be able to hold on to Gibraltar. Bronze we'll Tagus to try to hold as much as we can. Like, I'm not sure, like, while invading Spain, should we even try to hold Gibraltar? Or should we just let them take it? Because, like, there's no doubt we're going to win the war, but, like... Should we, just let, should we just, like, let them take it? Welp, Spain, you had a good run. But now, uh, it's over for you. Anyways. Let's make this quick. Since, realistically, they're not exactly going to survive. Oh, they're going to try to enter the ocean. Wait. Uh, oh, we can't conscript. Okay, well, I mean, it's still over for them anyways. So it doesn't really matter. Guys, a very interesting uh, fact about the Age of History 2. Uh, I think that once you capture a nation's capital, they're forced to accept a peace deal. Like, you know, guys, sometimes when you're, like, uh, weak in Age of History 2, uh, what happens is that sometimes nations won't accept to have a peace deal with you. I think that once you capture their capital, they're kind of forced to accept a peace deal. I'm not sure if that's a real feature, although I did hear that, so please comment down below if that's true. Anyways, let's continue the invasion even though I have absolutely nothing to talk about. I mean, besides the fact that we are literally just absolutely obliterating Spain. Uh, okay. What? Seriously? There they are, in Africa. I almost uh, forgot. Okay, and now 
give me your land. Okay, well that was easy. And now guys, please give me a moment to kind of just assimilate all of the land and also... Uh, oh, Algeria declared independence. Eh, don't worry. Wow, Slovenia is at war loss. Okay. Uh, we'll make this quick. Wait. Wait, what? Uh... Well, there they go. Not really sure what the AI was expecting. Okay. And now, guys, please give me a moment, yeah, to kind of just, uh, uh, assimilate all of this. Alright, guys, I'm back. I kind of just assimilated Spain, and our army is in the ocean for the one millionth time. Anyways, uh, oh, okay. Well, guys, now I guess we'll kind of just invade, uh, maybe... Once they find, we'll just see if we can annex Portugal. They refused. Okay, Algeria. Uh, okay, you can keep fighting them. Anyways, now, I guess we'll kind of just go for, like, uh... Maybe... I'm really not sure. Like, that's the main problem. Uh, Croatia, I guess? I mean... Sure, we don't really have anyone else to invade, so, like... What's really the worst that could happen? Algeria, you declared independence again. No. Anyways, now let's start the invasion. Wow, they actually didn't attack. That's pretty weird. Honestly, that's fine. Wow, they don't have any troops. Okay, I mean... To be honest, this invasion kind of just feels too easy. Wow, even Turkey is invading them, okay. Wow. And there's an entire 
entire war between Russia and China. Anyways, uh, now we can simulate like a million provinces. Wow, okay. So now, let's assimilate a million provinces. Well, not exactly a million, but like, you get why I mean. And if you're wondering now, like, why I can't the assimilation, it's because it's just really boring and takes a really long time. If anyone wants to see it for some reason, yeah, I guess I won't cut out this assimilation. How long is left till we can annex Algeria? Three turns. Okay. I don't really know why we're doing this. Actually, no, we're doing it because, you know, we don't want to revolt, but, like... Wait. No. No. Oh, here. I thought it was in the Sahel, and it would have been a lot more difficult to deal with. Bulgaria, as well. Look. Anyway, Serbia. Uh, let's get ready for a war with you. Even though, like, guaranteed we're going to win, no doubt. But, like, uh, just make sure that we don't lose. And I've just realized that we're not actually going to, like, use our, like, main army for this war, which is a little weird. I guess we won't, we won't like, uh, like, uh, we won't question that, basically. Well, uh, there they go. You will be missed. Never mind, that province doesn't border for some reason. Okay. We have a problem. Uh, we are going to need to reinforce this front a lot. And for some reason the game seems to be breaking. Hmm, weird. Never mind. Um, uh, okay, well, I mean, good enough. Seventeen turns, okay, amazing. Ten. I know we didn't have to do that, but honestly, uh, yeah, we'll take any money we can. Come on. so close to taking over the entire Mediterranean. Although we're mostly just doing it by, like, ultimatums, so I guess it's not that interesting. 
What the... What the heck happened here? Uh, fine, I guess we'll deal with this. Uh, give me your land. Somehow we have a colony in Egypt. I'm going to ignore that. Once they will grow the colony, because why not? And somehow Zambia is here. Uh, this is very weird. 13 turns. Okay, uh, Russia? There's no way they'll actually accept this, right? They actually accepted, okay, uh, uh... I have an idea. Just make sure that Russia wins the war against China, we're gonna do this. Because, you know, like, we are going to annex Russia anyways. So, like, uh, just make sure that, like, 100% we can get extra land. Uh, we're just going to help them in their war. There goes China. Almost. Trust me. Uh, eventually. Uh, no. Okay, I guess in the meantime we'll invade Portugal. I just realized maybe we should utilize our army. Right there, and uh, fine, we'll dump it all into colonization cost, even though I don't think that even does anything. Honestly, why not? Now send the rest of our army to the ocean. Declare war. And after we annex Russia, I think this is going to be the whole video, guys. breakthrough. Honestly, it doesn't really matter. Well, there they go. Now give me all your land. And, uh... I have an idea. Okay. Uh, let's send our entire army to the ocean, because, well... Why not? Come on. Come on, it really can't take that long. And, okay, at this point I think, like, uh... Let's just save.
what they actually refused knowing her. Wait, did they actually refuse? What the heck happened here? We're going to ignore that. So anyways... I kind of need to annex Russia. So... As uh, Serbia, you're gonna be my puppet as well. Oh. They came back. Indonesia, you are gonna go to war with them. Come on, it really can't take that long. Okay, honestly, this is kind of ridiculous. Please. Dude, come on. This is taking way too long. Just get the peace deal. Where even is China? One province. Five. What the? Come on. Dude, how is this even happening? What? No. Are you joking? Okay, come on, please. What the heck even happened to North America? Okay, 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 okay. Come on. Finally. Now we can annex them. And we're going to go totally broke trying to assimilate them. So, uh, okay. Well, guys, it's time to go completely broke after we annex Russia. Now, guys, there goes Russia. If they accept. They accepted. What the heck? Anyways, uh, we have a problem. This is going to take, an, like, an eternity to assimilate. So honestly, guys, uh, give me a moment. And uh, once that moment is over, uh, wow, there's a rebellion. I'm not even r remotely surprised. To be honest, I expected like a hundred provinces. So I'm actually really surprised. Taiwan. No. Okay, guys, please give me a moment. Yeah, take time just to simulate all of this because. Let's be honest, this is going to take a little eternity. Alright guys, I'm back. I mostly managed to assimilate Russia, and there's still a lot that we need to assimilate. But honestly, uh, I'm kind of fed up. I, like, I'm really not joking. Like, I actually went broke. I'm not joking. I lost all my money. Maybe this was a bad idea. There goes Serbia. And we've already gone broke. Okay. What? Seriously? Please, no. Uh, just give me back my land. Okay, cool. And we've gone broke again. Amazing. Trust me, guys, like, what, well, what happened? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there. Okay. Like, trust me, guys, after we finish uh, assimilating, that's literally gonna be it for the video.
think we finally finished. Yay! That was absolute chaos. And you know what? We need even more land. What? Okay. Uh, give me your land. And also your land. And now, guys... I guess we'll kind of just wait till we can annex Iraq and Abyssinia. And, uh, fine, you're gonna find them annexed in the blink of an eye. Alright guys, I'm back. Uh, there goes Ethiopia. Never mind, they actually refused. I am very surprised. Okay, uh... I guess we'll... I guess we'll just annex them in the next video. Anyways guys, I guess now we'll actually just annex Iraq. Now, guys, that's the whole video. If you enjoyed this video, please drop a like on this episode. Do we get the channel a ton? Uh, don't forget down below like uh, what we should do in the next episode. Because to be honest, I have a feeling this could probably end by episode three or episode four. We'll probably like totally conquer the world of Luxembourg by that point. I'm pretty sure because this challenge actually seems to be a lot easier than I first anticipated. Anyways, guys, uh, after we assimilate Iraq, I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Now. Like, right now. Okay. Wait. Okay, yeah, guys. See you in the next video.